In this video, I will show you where to find outbound link click data in Google Analytics 4. Hey, my name is Julius and welcome to the Analytics Mania YouTube channel, where I teach people how to work with Google Tag Manager and Google Analytics. So if you want to stay up to date with GE4, then consider subscribing to this channel. By default, Google Analytics can track not only page views, but also outbound link clicks. But finding that data in reports might be challenging for beginners. So let's take a look at how can you do that. Google Analytics 4 is capable of tracking not only page views, but some additional events. And they are part of the enhanced measurement. If you want to see if that is enabled in your property, because by default it is, you should go to admin, then data streams in the property column, and then select your website data stream. Here you will see the enhanced measurements section, and if it is enabled, then you can check what kind of events are tracked automatically. In this video, we are focusing on outbound clicks. And if you don't see it right here, you should click on this gear icon and then enable it here and then click save. After this is done, then Google Analytics will start tracking clicks when a visitor clicks on a particular link that redirects a visitor to another website. Those links are also known as outbound links. So after you have been collecting outbound link clicks for at least 24 hours or more, then in your event reports, which are in the reports section and engagement, here you will see a list of your events and the outbound link event will be named click. This particular event is the one that is related to this tracking right here. But right now, all we see is that there was this event tracked. This is how many times this event was tracked and this is how many total users clicked on any of the outbound links on a website. But if you click on this link event right here, you won't see what kind of links were clicked. And this is the most important part when it comes to outbound link click tracking, because you want to know what kind of links are clicked. To do that, you will need to use explorations. So in the sidebar of Google Analytics 4, click Explore, then choose Freeform, or you can choose Blank. In fact, let's choose Blank in this case. And then you will need to add dimensions. So click plus right here. And we are going to work with several of them. The first one is the event. This is event name. And then we are going to add another dimension, which is called link URL. Because when click event is tracked by Google Analytics 4, it also automatically tracks the link URL parameter. Click it and then click import. Here in the metrics section, you can add, for example, event count, because we want to know how many times was each link clicked. You can also include metrics such as total users right here, click checkbox and then import. And now let's build a report that will show the most clicked outbound links. So first of all, double click on link URL or just drag it to the rows section and then double click these two metrics because they will be included in the report as well. Double click this, double click that. What you will most likely see is that the first line is empty. This is because right now this report includes all events on a website, not just click events, but all events. This includes page views, maybe video events, maybe something else. Right now, we just want to focus on that particular outbound click event. That is why we should scroll down and in filters, click right here and then select event name. We see it right here because we have it added right here. So click event name and then that event must exactly match and then enter click and then click apply. Now we have narrowed down just to that particular event and its data. Since this is a demo property, I don't have a lot of data, but maybe selecting a longer time period will help. All right, so now I have several values of the link URL, but if you were working on the actual real life property, then you should definitely see more items right here. By default, this list would display only 10 rows, but you can increase that number to 100, for example and then you will see those most popular events. When I'm recording this video, what is inconvenient in explorations is that you cannot change the width of each column and you cannot see the end of the URL very clearly. Hopefully in the future they will do that. So maybe you will see some indicators that allow you to resize, but right now your pretty much only way is to hide these two columns by clicking these dashes right here. And that would at least a little increase the size of this column. 
If you have just implemented Google Analytics or you have just enabled that outbound click tracking, you need to be more patient. Standard reports might take up to 24 hours to start displaying data in GA4, but exploration reports might take even up to 48 hours. So if you don't see your data still after 24 hours, you will need to wait 24 hours more. And that is how you can view outbound link click data in Google Analytics 4. If you found this video useful, hit the thumbs up button below the video because it helps me continue working on this channel. Also, if you want to learn more about Google Tag Manager or Google Analytics 4, then consider subscribing to this channel. My name is Julius, this is Analytics Mania, and I'll see you in the next video.